Hi, right, hello guys, uh, Johnny here of uh, Playing Genshin Impact. Today we're gonna be abusing the energy resource build on Mona. And specifically, why we're doing it on Mona because she has a talent called Waterborne Destiny. Basically, 20% of her energy resource will be converted to Hydro Damage Bonus. And you can check how much Hydro Damage Bonus that you could have by checking it on the, uh, by highlighting the attributes. Then you go, scroll it, scroll it, scroll it, with your PS4 board, of course. The Hydro Damage Bonus, nice. is, it is 38.1%, and that is almost half. So basically, you, her Hydro Damage Bonus is increased by 38.1% and that is really really good, especially with Energy Recharge Rate um, also, you know, contributing to your um, overall power, overall manpower. Ah, word, word, hello, hello. Uh, I'm just gonna say it, damage, okay? So basically, you can just reactivate your... Uh, astrologers must rid themselves of material desires. Only by ridding oneself of clutter can one see the true world around them. Um, okay Mona, okay Mona, I'm, re I'm recording, I'm sorry. Alright, so basically, the more energy recharge rate you have, uh, the faster that you that faster that you will get more energy or recharge your energy so that you can cast your energy ulti, uh, elemental burst much faster basically we're gonna i'm just gonna demonstrate to you guys by doing a ley line because i really need some uh, some you know xp materials for mona i have been able uh, i have been able to master yet to level 80 but uh, we're gonna be fine we're gonna be fine so yeah we're gonna, we're gonna demonstrate to you okay watch out for that elemental burst right now my elemental burst is ready for mona i'm gonna be mainly using mona for every encounter that we're gonna get if it is possible if we're not facing against a hydro especially a a, a hydro pa, a hydro okay. abyss mage okay good all right we got pressure hoarder let's see i'm gonna cast it you all very much know that you know mona's elemental uh, burst is really powerful because it's like it's like a debuff on the enemy if the enemies got debuffed by your by her elemental burst or which is called Stellaris Phantasm, basically when you hit on your next attack, it will trigger the debuff. It's like a time bomb that you have to trigger. But at the same time, if you don't uh, activate the Stellaris, Stellaris Phantasm uh, manually, you can just uh, just leave the end with the debuff, and the debuff will just go off after for a short time. See that? See? See? I just cast my elemental burst two times in one encounter and this will be the third one nope. uh, let's, let's wait let's wait let's wait for that there we go now i'm gonna cast this again there we go uh, i'm not gonna kill this guy let's wait for the uh, stellaris pantato or the omen diva to go away nah, there we go easy 9 9.8k and i get to i get my uh my expert. hello Let's do that again, let's do that again, let's do that again. Hold on, hold on for a second. We got some, uh, you know, look at that guy over there. Look at that guy over there. Woo! That's gonna hit oh, me. That's gonna hit me. You've done this. Well, you know what? I'll give you the, I'll, gi I'll, I'll give you, I'll give you an A for an effort. Delve right. into destiny. There we go. See? Get yourself a fire over there. And uh, I will do this. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Oh. Now it's time for another, uh, time for another ley line. Ley line, XP ley line. Let me go there for a second, let me go there for a second. There we go, there we go. Uh, as you can see, you know, I, I'm using Mona Sprint. It's because um, she has a talent that basically alters her sprinting movement. <laughs> this, this Animo Slime, dude. This, this Animo Slime. This Animo Slime, there we go. Now you're out of the way. Okay. We're gonna do it for the second time, okay? Now, right now, I have half of my energy for my Elemental Burst, okay? Let me heal first, I guess. Let me heal first, I guess. We have Barbara, our wonderful healer. Our wonderful Jean sister. That might be a spoiler, but uh, you know, just pretend that you didn't hear it. Alright, let's see, let's see. Do it again, let's do it again. Second time, second time. Ah. Oh, it's a ruin guard. Alright. Alright, I'm not gonna use my uh, lightning guard, okay? Let's just, let's just do Mona. Let's just do Mona. What the fuck? It might, it might look like slower to you right now. For my elemental burst to cool down, right there, did you see that? Did you see that? I gain a large shot of energy, and my elemental burst is ready once again. Oh, she's doing that. Alright, time to cast the stars phantasm. Trigger the omen. We got 5k and an 10, almost 10k. That's really cool. Now, I'm just gonna... You see, Mona also has a passive talent skill, which basically, um... When you have been sprinting for more than 2 seconds and the enemies are on, she will leave a reflection of doom. It's like 
it's like your elemental skill, but it doesn't last for much longer and it just explodes after after a short time. There you go. Now I see I have I have half again of my elemental uh, elemental burst and I got particles again. Oh yeah, before I kill this roving guard. The reason why I get nope. so much uh never mind. I cannot change my uh party yet. It's one way to see your elemental resonances for your whole party. Let me kill this roving guard. There we go. I may have not cast my elemental burst for two times, but I did cast it for one time and look, 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 look. My elemental burst is ready again. Is it that good, Chimona? Alright. Now, let me get my uh, let me get my rewards, guys. Let me get my rewards. See? There we go. Alright. I have uh, how much lessons do I have yet? I still have 20, I still have 20. You can do one more, one more, one more, okay? You can do one more. Alright. Now, uh, I wanna show it again to you guys for the third time. Just so you know that um, I can really really suggest that energy recharge build are so good and it is so viable for many many characters the, uh, To be honest, I can show you that I actually use an energy recharge weapon for Razor Wait, there's an enemy again. God damn it. Right. Should I use my elemental burst? No, 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 no. Alright. Oh, she had thrown a goddamn pebble on me. You just stop that good kill it off, sir. Thank you. Alright, 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 uh, let me show you something guys, on my part is, wait, how come I cannot change it again, it's like one trick guys, to know if you have, if you have an enemy near your vicinity or not, oh no, mission failed, we'll get them next time, okay, <laughs> they didn't see me, god damn it, alright, yeah, might as well do it here, alright, I'm gonna cast my Stellaris, uh, my Stellaris Phantasm, that's my elemental skill for the Tom, there we go, kill them, Alright, hey, here. I have half of my elemental burst again ready. And it's almost half. It's almost full. You see that? And it's ready again. And take in mind, guys. I just casted it. I just casted it. Isn't that amazing? Alright. We're gonna do this one last ley line over here. But before I do that, I've been for I've been meaning to actually show it to you guys. There's a reason. Why I, ha why I have two Electro party members on my party and two Hydro but let's just take a look at Electro here see that? high voltage affected by Hydro blah 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 but we do not really care about it this is the one thing that we care about superconduct overloaded and Electro charge or elemental reactions such as those three have a 100% chance to generate an Electro elemental particle and it has and it can only trigger for every 5 seconds but 5 seconds guys take in mind that is really really fast and for an energy recharge build for your, for the character that you use, that is really really convenient. Since if you're if you're the car if you have the character who has a tendency to you to rely most of the time on on his or her elemental burst, it will be beneficial for that character to build to have an energy recharge or at least you know um, an artifact, a sense artifact that actually give her a much energy recharge. Uh, like take a look at this, okay? Gladiator's longing, sense of Eon, uh on mass enhancement of a 5 star artifact, it gives you a 51.8% energy recharge. Uh, I don't know really if you can actually put more energy recharge on the substat, but I don't think that is possible because, because that would be clearly broken for the game, for the game, you know, yeah, for the game. But uh, yeah, I'll take a substat of elemental mastery and attack, uh, attack percent, crit rate percent, and uh, you know, defense, uh, uh, you know what guys, this is an RNG game, what can you expect? You can get anything almost there uh, it, although if i did get a quick damage of that i don't think i would ever change the sense so uh, you know what? time to wrap it up guys i'm gonna show you again okay elemental burst we're gonna abuse it again we're gonna abuse it again we're gonna cast many elemental bursts as we can in this one in this one last encounter we have on this third again okay there we go oh we have helios okay i'm gonna cast it one that's my elemental skill reflection of doom Trigger the omen. See that 16k? That can only happen when I actually do a crit. Oh, she is spicy. I may use Elisa, but you know, I, I just want to show you just on that one character when she has an energy recharge build. See? My energy. Come on, dude. Alright. Let me hit. Okay. Casting my um, Phantasm for the second time. There we go. That's my elemental skill for the pump. Oh, he's not dead yet. Okay. 
Okay, 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 okay. There we go. He's the last one. He's the last one. Why are you bullying me? Oh, ho, ho, ho. You're speeding, big boy. Yeah, do that. You do that. He's gonna look here. Okay. There we go. Let me charge attack this guy. Let me charge attack again this guy. There we go. And that is, guys, the end of the abusing of the energy recharge. Card. Abusing of the energy recharge. Card. Let me get this. Let me get my loot. Alright. For one, for one last time, I, I want to show it again to you guys again. How the energy recharge build actually, um, you know, how is it? How is it actually wonderful in this game? To be honest, it's really convenient if you put it on the damage step character because if <laughs> yeah, yeah, like yeah, sure, you don't really get the highest amount of damage you could actually inflict on your enemies if you're using an energy recharge build. But you have to take in mind, but that the more times you could cast your elemental burst in one encounter by soloing to be honest it's really con it's really really uh, handy when you're playing solo like most of the time like if you do if you do domains and if you do bosses alone you could just do energy recharge build. you know what let's find a suitable boss first to kill okay hmm uh, i guess i could try it on a fire right just fine yeah, yeah let's do that let's do that let's do that all right we just teleported Sorry guys for the wait. Yeah, yes, for loading takes some time. Never mind. I found the chest Hello. first. You know what? Let's, let's get that chest first. Oh, there's a wolf flower. Oh, oh, yeah. Let's go for her first. There we go. The buffer. Oh, we got two. Alright. I'll take it. Take in mind guys, vaporize doesn't really really affect your elemental resonance for your party. So you don't really get the particle yet. It only affects when you're using superconduct and uh, overload and electrocharge. But uh, that's okay. We have energy recharge build. The only reason why I have two electro because I use Lisa and Mona like all the time. You know, Mona Lisa. Let me cast it again. I cast it for the second time. If you have been counting, see that? 16.6k. That's a big amount of damage, especially when you're critical damaging. Alright, let's do it here. Let's do it here. Let's do it here. Before we do it on a boss or on the pyro, is fine. Alright. Put the elemental skill. Oh, they have shields. Never mind. Alright, let's do this first. Alright, this, this guy's gonna be annoying. I'm gonna put Lisa's elemental burst much. here. And uh, let me put some elemental skill for Mona. You know, this is not. This is a bad camera angle. Let me do this first. There we go. Alright. So basically, you can see the effect of the elemental uh, resonance. There we go. See? What the? Hello? Into destiny. There we go. <laughs> I was wondering, why the hell is not trying? He's not dying there. We're gonna go to the boss. But before we do that, let me deal. There we go. Alright, there we go. Now we're gonna deal with this guy. I'll try to evade most of our attacks. But as you know, you know, th th this boss, this boss can be uh, a little bit feisty. It's uh, just a little bit feisty. For a fire plant, you know? For a fire plant. Alright, let's What's do it. What's up, fuckers? The boy. You have to destroy the horse. Alright, let me charge attack that. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Make sure I have more stamina. There we go. Put some reflection. Okay, there we go. No, oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna evade that. Nah 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 nah. Alright, I don't have stamina yet. Let me just normal attack. I don't really have any constellation yet for Mona. Because, uh, you know, I'm a free-to-play player. I don't really uh, spend money on this game. It's not because I don't want to. It's just because, you know, why would you spend money when you can just save? Oh, no. Let me heal. Come on. Thank you, Barbara. Okay, there we go. Now, I cast my first Terrace Phantasm. Now, if you don't have energy recharge build, for a specific example for this Mona, I don't think you could actually cast your um, Elemental Burst really. On the first minutes of your boss fight. But as you can see, I was able to cast it before the uh, Pyro Registine HPs get into half. Alright, let me charge attack this guy. Alright, you see that? You see that my elemental burst? It's almost ready again. Let me put this elemental skill. Mm, no, 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 no. You're not gonna hit me with that. She has no force this time. Okay, I have deal with her brutally. Okay, so we do that. Attack. Thank you. Sometimes I exploit. The, the attacks of the enemies by waiting for the right frame before they attack so that I could use my elemental burst 
to, um, to, you know, big brain their path. So you could just basically evade them by just casting your elemental burst. Shadows of fate. So you, you really use your elemental burst just so that you can avoid some uh, some attacks of the boss. It's not one trick that you could use for any for any. Yeah. 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 The pyro red spot or the boss use that attack. So you know, try to big brain me, try to deal with those AOEs. But you know, I just have to use the elemental burst. And for the last touch, cast that omen. And now we're done. Actually, Do not yet. Alright, let's sprint. Let's sprint. Let's sprint. Let's sprint. There we go. Got it. There ah. we go. Abusing the energy recharge field. So um, if you counted that, if you counted it correctly, I think I have casted my elemental burst or the Stellaris Phantasm three times. And uh, yeah, that's uh, that's the uh, abusing of the energy recharge build. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Uh, I will create more videos like this, creating more gameplay builds, which you can uh, find interesting, which you may you know, which you may guys find more to maybe it will fit your playstyle maybe it will fit the character that you like maybe because you don't know what type of build you want to do for your character so uh, if this video helps out for your in your favor um that would be nice really nice, really nice. anyway i'm just gonna i'm just gonna do a take a photo for the outro and uh just think about it so yeah, thank you guys all for watching and uh, I'll see you on the next video. Have a good day.